Hi friends, I'm Manzur Siddiqui, SQL Server DBA. Today we are going to discuss about uh, database SQL Server credentials, how to configure credentials. So uh, SQL Server credentials are used to access external resources of Windows by enabling SQL Server login. Credential creates an internal connectivity with SQL Server login to outside resources so that by using SQL Server login you can fetch or access those resources. These credentials are SQL Server database objects only which is used for accessing outside applications or resources and passwords are encrypted using service master key in this method. Using a Windows identity a user who is connected to SQL Server with SQL Server authentic authentication can access outside resources of SQL Server instance. One SQL Server login can be mapped to only one credential but single credentials can be mapped, mapped to multiple SQL Server logins. So now we will see how we can configure credential in SQL Server. We can create creden credentials by TSQL or by SSMS. We will see both methods. So I'll go to my SQL Server Management Studio and we'll open, open uh, Query Editor. This is my Query Editor window and this is my query which I have already written. So first of all uh, we'll check whether we have any credentials on this instance or not. I'll just use master select a star from sys.credentials and execute it. I have two credentials okay and this is from my past uh, uh, tutorial of uh, transactional uh, replication so I will create new credential okay to create new credential you have syntax create credential your credential name with identity equals to you have to give your identity that is external user which is mapped to access outside resources so you can uh, go to you can uh, choose uh, from your uh, active directory uh, which has access okay and you can give secret equals to you can give a strong password so secret is basically a password of this identity so I'll just select it and execute so this credential is created DB credentials okay this is for alter cred credential right now I'm not executing it I'll just cross check with sys dot credentials uh, right now we have created db underscore credentials so I'll select a star from sys dot credentials and execute it we have our third credential db underscore credential which is created okay so we can uh, check this credential in object explorer I'll just refresh it credentials and this is db underscore credentials which is created now if you want to alter this credential okay with different identity uh, which is a different uh, user or if you want to change password so you can use alter uh, credential your credential name with identity and your secret equals to you can give new secret new password so I'll just select it and execute it so I have changed my password of this credential now I'll go to alter okay alter login I have one uh, login Lisa which has access so I want to map this DB credential with this login Lisa so alter login your login name add credential your credential name select it and execute okay so before executing I want to show you that Lisa don't have DB credential already okay I'll go to login I'll just refresh it this is Lisa login and you can see this map to credential is not checked I'll just close it I'll go to my query auto login and execute it execute it successfully I'll refresh this login I'll open Lisa properties and now you can see map to credential and from drop-down this is selected db underscore credentials by query 
so I'll just click close okay so we have created credential we have altered credential then we have mapped credential to our login I'll just drop it right now so that we can uh, check with SSMS drop cannot drop the credential because it is used by a server principal okay no problem okay I'll just check it so we are getting this error because uh, we have mapped this DB credential to uh, this login account so I'll first remove this uh, DB credential from this login account you can go to properties of login and you can unmap it okay now you can uh, drop credential and execute it your uh, credential is dropped now I'll just check it select a start from sys.credentials okay execute it now uh, my third credential is deleted dropped so the same thing we are going to do okay I'll just refresh it this is gone okay so we'll check this with the uh, SQL Server Management Studio I'll just delete it okay I'll, I'll refresh my node so uh, this is my database security and credentials okay so right click on credentials new credential you can give a credential name db underscore credential now you can give your identity which is a external user uh, to map uh, you can select it from your active directory or a network user okay I have one user so I'll select that okay click on OK now you can give password and click on OK now this our credential is created db underscore credential and will map this credential to a login so go to login I'll just refresh it once go to login right click on login and go to properties in general tab you have mapped to credential uh, tick mark on it you have drop down you'll get your uh, credential select your credential and click on add button okay now you have uh, default database and language etc so click on ok now we have created a uh, credential and map to your login so uh, it completes our uh, SQL Server credential configuration if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel uh, on YouTube or you can visit to my website sqlserverlog.com and you can subscribe to newsletter or you can join me on Facebook sign up or you can also go to uh, my channel and subscribe here on YouTube if you have any query you can uh, send to me okay thank you